Hey everyone, Roman here. Uh, I haven't uploaded a video in a very long time. Uh, this is my friend and co-founder, Arthur. Hey, nice to meet you. Um, so that means I started a startup and you might be guessing that it has something to do with agriculture and you'd be correct. So what we do is we allow specialty crop growers to manage water and fertilizer delivery at a very high precision uh, on their field. So for example, the way that these vineyards, such as the one that I'm at now, is irrigated, is this whole section you see in front of me will get the exact same amount of water. But that's actually not the optimal way to do it. Uh, there are many different soil types with different soil holding capacities in this big block you see here. So the vines that are in the soils that don't hold water as well will not grow as vigorously. Um, so they'll be low yield. But the vines that are in the soils here that hold a lot of water, they'll grow over vigorously, meaning uh, they'll grow very high yield, which in wine grape growing um, is correlated with bad quality. So the ideal way to irrigate something like this would be to actually break up this whole section you see here into sub irrigation zones. And that's exactly what we're doing with uh, some IOT technology, as well as uh, different algorithms to control those uh, IOT devices. And what exactly are those IOT devices? Well, they're LoRa connected water valves that are wireless uh, and battery powered and very easy to install into uh, existing drip irrigation systems like the one here. And uh, yeah, let's, let's actually go take a look at one. So we can see that there are tubes that run down every row of grapes. And these tubes are the uh, things that carry water. And there is a hole in the tube uh, about every two feet and water drips out of the tube onto the vines and that's how they're watered. So what we do is we control uh, which sections of these rows are turned on and off. And there are now sections in this block that receive more water than other sections, and some sections in this block that actually receive no water. And in doing that, we've been able to uh, allow the vines in this vineyard to grow a lot more uniformly. Uh, so now we see uniform yield and uniform quality, and that translates to more profit for the grower because uh, for, for a variety of different reasons. Uh, but one being due to higher quality grapes, uh, they now have a larger portion of their block uh, growing higher quality grapes from being able to control the water, as well as uh, more profit due to water savings, labor savings from being able to irrigate remotely, uh, as well as being able to increase yield in some areas as well. Those all translate to profit increases. Um, oh yeah, and here's one of the devices. So as you can see, uh, we have our microcontroller unit, battery and wireless module in there. And then we have a water valve here. And in this vineyard block, we actually have uh, I think we have around 40 of these devices in this vineyard block and they're all communicating with a gateway device, a lower gateway device, which is on that windmill there. And that gateway communicates with all these lower devices and then sends their packets um, up to the internet where uh, they go to our online dashboard and are able to be viewed there. As well, we're able to send down packets with commands to open or close these valves in an intelligent way. So uh, on the vineyard here, it's actually almost uh, harvest time. These grapes are uh, just about ready to go. So as you can see, you can squeeze it and water will come out. They're, they're really soft. I think they're gonna harvest in a couple weeks. Um, yeah, and Arthur, what would you say is the, the long-term goal of the startup? Yeah, so if we, if we think about it at a farm level, right, what we're really trying to do is we're trying to personalize healthcare for plants. Like right now, the way that 
um, you know, your farms that put food on your table, manage crops is, uh, they do a lot of things on a kind of field level. Um, but it turns out that, you know, every plant is unique, just like humans really. Um, and so you need to give each of your plants a unique amount of water and fertilizer and other nutrients. So that's what we're really trying to do. We're trying to create a, uh, eventually in the future, we want to be able to give every plant just the right amount of water and nutrients down to the plant level. Um, and we're hoping by doing that, we can really optimize that, the way that food is produced. Cool. Um, and this is product number one, uh, which is being able to uh, manage uh, irrigation at the most optimal level. Um, so being able to irrigate sub, sub acre, uh, but being a company, uh, there are many more products that are on the horizon. And our main goal is to grow more better quality food for the many more people that are going to be on this planet and do it in a climate resilient way and a way that's uh, sustainable for the planet. So that's the goal. And we've been able to raise a little bit of money uh, so far to help us along this journey. Uh, but I think there's, there are going to be a lot of exciting updates in the future. And if you're interested to learn more about any part of the startup or any part of the technology, um, just shoot me a message, leave it down below, and maybe we'll film a video on it. All right. Cool. Thanks, everyone. Nice meeting Bye. you. Bye.